Hello, good morning or good evening to everyone. Welcome to Mainframe t Tutorials. This is COBOL Tutorials of 12th part. So this is the continuation to my previous video. So here in this video I would like to share uh, something about the difference between string and unstring and search and search all. So this might be useful for the beginners, learners or it might be also sometimes useful for uh, in, when you are attending foreign interviews. So let's see the difference between string and unstring. So string is used to merge multiple variables into single variables and unstring it is used to split the single variables into multiple variables. So if I t uh, tell about the example of this using string so you have a name, sub, a surname and a middle name as a three different fields and in this if you want to merge this as a single name so you can merge those individual different fields to a single fields in the same way for unstring so you have a variable called a timestamp so in timestamps you will have date time and everything so you want to split these into multiple variables then you can go and use for unstring so it is terminated with n string and it is terminated with n unstring in the multiple sending fields in this multiple sending fields and one receiving field sorry are used yes only one sending field and multiple receiving fields are used we can also use with pointer option is used to specify the starting position of receiving field whereas here with pointer option is used to specify starting position of sending field so important note here is uh, no dot are allowed that is no period are allowed between string and unstring so in the same way periods are no periods are allowed between unstring and and unstring so this is the difference between these are the main dif major difference between string and unstring so let's see the difference between search and search all so when you say search it is a linear search when you say search all it is a binary search what's exactly the difference here is here the data needs to be in a sorted order uh, sorry here the data need not be in a sorted order here the data should be in a sorted order either it should be in ascending or in descending order that is in search all so coming to search search can be applied for one dimensional array two dimensional array or multi dimensional array whereas for search all it is strictly for one dimensional array so here the access is a little bit slow uh, compared to search all search all is faster than uh, search why because the data is already sorted in order and uh, either that is either in ascending or deserve that makes the search faster and it is mainly only used for one dimensional here we can use one dimensional two dimensional multi dimensional here we can use multiple when conditions that is in search whereas in search all you can use only one when condition the set verb is used to increment or decrement the next value no set verb is required in search all so we can use any relational operators in search only equal to operator is used in search all so these are the difference between the search and search all uh, so this might be very very uh, useful for the beginners especially when they are learning when they are new to this uh, cobar programming and it is also very helpful uh, when you attend for interview or and uh, for better programming so it is good to have these differences and uh, get started in uh, working on this thank you so much for uh, watching this video i hope you got you have got, got a good information on this have a great and pleasurable day